sunshines, welcome back and thanks for popping in. I am so glad you're here. Y'all, the fall subscription boxes are starting to roll in and my little ginger heart is going pitter patter. I love fall most of all. I know that's sort of an overused saying, but it's totally true. I love the colors of fall, the burnt oranges and navy blues, olive greens, mustard yellows. I love when you get that first crisp day of fall. The air just smells so clean, but I also love the sense of pumpkin spice and the flavors of that and crisp apple. I love the home decor for fall, the cozy blankets and the little twinkle lights. I love being able to put on a jacket or a cozy sweater. And as much as I love all of those things, I love fall subscription boxes even more because all those things I just talked about are usually in these boxes. And I have a fall box to share with you. It is the My Trove Box for fall 2023. Now, My Trove Box is a home decor slash, I'm going to say entertaining type of subscription box. Corinne is the owner. She likes uh, very sustainable pieces. She likes to work with small businesses and companies that give back. I feel like this is a very special type of box. And you guys asked and she listened. Last year, she kind of combined fall and winter together, but this time we are going to get a fall box and a winter box, so definitely stay tuned for that. In this box, you are going to get, I believe, six items. The cost of this box is $224.95 a quarter. If after watching this video, you decide you maybe don't wanna subscribe, but you wanna get this particular box, you can pay an extra $10, $234.95 and grab this one. Or if you're so in love with it, you know you're going to love it year round, you can be an annual member. That way you get to customize some of your items and you are going to save over $100 off your boxes throughout the year, which is really, really great. Now I do have a discount code for $15 and that code you can use once a year. What's unique about this code and I think is really great is you can use it on this particular subscription box. You can use it on one of their welcome boxes. Sometimes in between seasons, she'll bring out a smaller limited edition box um, that you can pick up. You can use it in her marketplace, y'all. If you are looking for the perfect hostess gift or something interesting for a holiday or birthday gift coming up. I've used her website several times to do exactly that. You can use that $15 off a $100 purchase in her marketplace, or she has a new holiday shop. Let me tell you, go over there. I just peruse just a little bit. There is a like bell, like big, huge bell garland. Oh, it's so delicious. And this gorgeous star garland. And if you liked the little candle advent calendar that she did last year in her box, it is back in the holiday shop, y'all. I know the Georgia Sunshine community went gaga for that. It is back. So you can use that $15 coupon off a $100 purchase one time in the year for any of that. We're going to just go ahead and dive in because I am dying to see all of these pieces in person. I do follow her on Instagram, so I've seen a few things and my jaw has dropped a couple of times. This is what the box looks like. It's so, so pretty. And then I'm gonna push back just a little bit. She always has a signature tissue, but she changes it up with the season in terms of color. So let's see what color she did. Oh, it's this beautiful green. And it looks like this. Can you see? Isn't it beautiful with the birds and the leaves? Oh my goodness, I love it. When you open it up, this is what you see inside. Now I am just gonna give you a little hint. I did already open the box and pull out the information because I wanted to read through it really, really quickly. So you will get this little My Trove Box paper newsletter. But when you get this box, there is a little link right here at the bottom. She does an online newspaper or newsletter, I guess you would call it. And it's got recipes, entertaining ideas, how to style some of the items in your box. Some of the articles are about items um, in the box and where they came from, the history behind them, which I think is really great. So don't sleep on that. She takes a lot 
of care in doing that. So let's hear about this box. It's fall, y'all. My Trove box loves the season as we head into the autumn months. The cooler dips in temperatures, breaking out the lightweight sweaters, and getting the house ready to entertain family and friends. We also understand during this busy time, pulling together a cohesive holiday look or coming up with a festive DIY may not always be in the cards. The reality is between work and family obligations or possibly being the household that hosts the family get togethers, you're probably already exhausted running around, which is why when planning out the items included in our fall box, we kept ease and simplicity in mind. I love that. For this holiday season, and because you asked for it, my trove box is back with two separate boxes for fall and winter. I'm so happy she made that decision. Our fall box will have uh, you covered for an easy transition into autumn holidays and beyond. We drew inspiration from natural elements to in-season produce and neutrals. Where there's cooler weather, a little fire element creating a warm glow never hurt anyone. That's one of my favorite things about fall and winter when the um, it gets darker earlier as we do the time change. I love having fairy lights and candles glowing all through my house. It just adds to that festive, warm and cozy ambiance in my home. So I'm excited she uh, picked that element. More importantly, because of their versatility, our decor items will take you beyond the fall all the way through the spring thaw. So multifunctional items, it sounds like. Be sure to follow along our social media and access our quarterly online magazine for styling tips, seasonal recipes, and entertaining ideas. You may even find a winter box Easter egg in one of the pictures. Don't forget our holiday shop de de uh, debuts in August. We've got holiday decor, lots of last minute hostess gifts, stocking stuffers, and fun holiday bundles at some great pieces. Definitely go check that out because I find some really great holiday gifts over there. Okay, and then on the back, she gives you what's called the nitty gritty. It tells us all the things in the box. I'm gonna set this aside. You can already see one of the items and I love it. This is one of those items I can definitely see carrying us all the way through spring and this is what it looks like. It is a garland. It's a eucalyptus garland. And can you see the little white kind of flowers interspersed? Now you'll have to give this a little zhuzh. You know, it can go on your mantle, your kitchen island. It would be beautiful sprayed across your dining room table. Gosh, this is long. It's gotta be, what's a standard garland? Six feet maybe? Isn't it beautiful? I love eucalyptus. This has got some brighter leaves. And then one side of it does have the little hook. You can always turn garlands into wreaths if you want. Just tie the end up with a little wire. Stick a couple of red berry sprigs in here if you wanted to make this a wreath during the holidays or something. I love that idea too. So it says the uh, six foot, I was right, eucalyptus garland mixed with green rosemary. That's what that is. Oh, I see it. Hold on. I see the green rosemary, right? here. Right here. Do you see it? That's so pretty. Mixed with green rosemary seeds. Um, this versatile piece can be used along your dining room or buffet table or as a part of a centerpiece. For transition into winter, we suggest you mix in decorative holiday picks or couple with pine cones and greenery for a full lush look that brings the outdoors inside on your home. And I actually saw her take this garland and mix it with some pine on her dining room table. It looked so incredibly beautiful. It says, hint, you'll want to pair this with one of the winter items for your mantle or doorway for the holiday season. So this is actually gonna go with something that we're gonna get in the winter box, which I think is really, really exciting. I wanted to do this last year and I did it, but I wanted to take all of my little cloches and do, I have all kinds of cloches. Um, and I wanna do them on my Breck or my buffet in my dining room and then do garland in front of it and I want to put a bunch of like Santas like vintage looking Santas underneath all those cloches and this would be perfect mixed with some little red berry picks that's how I'm going to use this doesn't that sound really really cool I am so excited to do that because y'all know I'm a sucker for a cloche anyway all right let's keep going the next thing in here came in a set of three. 
Now this is one of the items that if you were an annual member, you are able to customize. I'm gonna open them really quickly so you don't have to hear all the bar. All right, so this next item actually comes as a set of three and it's one of the items where if you're an annual member, you're actually able to customize because it comes in two colors a honey color that's more like a warm wheat or a cognac color which is a little bit darker and moodier. It is a set of three resin basket weave pumpkins. They look like they're made out of a basket material, but they're actually resin, which means these are gonna hold up so much better. A lot of my like bigger holiday items I put up in the attic and I find that baskets and things don't handle the heat through the summer, um, but I like the resin of these. So we've got this little guy, we've got this little guy, now I think she sent me a combo of both just so you could kind of see the colors, but you're either gonna get a set of three in this color or in this color. And like I said, if you're an annual member, you can pick. And then there's a little baby guy. Isn't he adorable? I love the little pumpkins. So you can kind of put these together or you can sort of sprinkle them throughout your home. Like he would be cute on a tiered tray. He could be in your entryway. He could be mixed. Um, maybe on your kitchen counter. Isn't that adorable? All right, let's read about those guys. It says set of three basket weave pattern pumpkins, two colors to choose from, honey or cognac. These festive pumpkins with an intricate basket weave pattern are sure to be an essential part of any fall decor. I mean, I feel like you can't do fall decor without pumpkins, right? Um, group and style in threes or place them individually around your home for a fresh natural take on fall made with resin that comes in two colors honey or cognac best styled as decorative pieces please do not use uh in the unprotected outdoors so these are indoor pumpkins even though they're resin they probably are not going to hold up in the elements aren't they beautiful so i'll give you a closer look one more time and again what am i going to say about the top knots i'm picky <laughs> about pumpkin top knots and these these are good top knots that is how I judge a pumpkin, by how its top knot looks. And fake ones, ooh, it can be really upscale or really cheap looking just based on that top knot, and these are really good. So you have a tall, a medium, a mama bear, a baby bear, and a daddy bear, kind of, except they're pumpkins. Those are beautiful. Those are gonna last for years and years and years. The quality of these, the attention to detail, even it looks like wood on the top of the vine of the pumpkin, really, really good. All right, this next item is so cool. It is such a well thought out decor piece for so many different reasons. We get a set of two, each are individual items in the box, so you can use them together or you can break them up and use them in different items of your home. The first thing is this beautiful half moon candelabra. It's got a really beautiful size to it. What I think is genius about the construction of this is it comes as a base, the poles, which just stick into the holes here, and then the candle holders. So you can break this totally down for easy storage. It would go in a drawer, lickety split, no problem, and a little cabinet, and won't take up that much room, believe it or not. Um, I just did the taller poles in the middle and kind of had it streaming down. Isn't that stunning but in addition to this guy we also got a little smaller half moon candelabra i think during a family dinner um just having the flickering lights um of maybe some tea light candles maybe some battery operated ones they still make the ones that look like they have a little flicker to their glow would be absolutely stunning if you're hosting a family get together maybe christmas or thanksgiving you want to just do it buffet style this would be beautiful down your kitchen island because you could use this either together or separately you know i just got an idea this if you put these in between each other like this. This would be gorgeous in a fireplace or on a hearth. Oh, yes. Or you could do it maybe like this. Hold on, I don't wanna break anything. Where you do it more like an S down your dining room table. I, you know what, I'm gonna do it on my TV stand over here and mix the garland sort of going in between the candelabras. Oh my goodness, 
Let me do that really quickly. Let's see what it looks like. Hang on. Okay, the lighting in my bedroom is not the best and you can kind of see the shadows on the wall, but bear with me, you'll kind of see what I mean. So I just took the candelabras and I just moved them in two different directions and just set the garland on Because I've got the high candle to the lower one in terms of height, I would probably add one or two glass tea light holders on either side just to add a little extra here. Um, you you can mix pine cones with this for fall. You can mix uh, pine branches, like go to the Christmas tree shop. A lot of times when people are buying Christmas trees, they'll cut the bottoms off and a lot of times they'll give you those. So it adds a little scent of Christmas to fill it out just a little bit. I always have trouble after Christmas knowing how to decorate my dining room table. This is perfect. You can keep it on your mantle or put it on your table. Let's talk about this garland for a minute. I know we've all had cheap garlands from like the craft store and you fight with them to get them to lay exactly like you want. This one I've barely touched, but every way I've made it move, it stayed exactly where I put it. So this is not one that you're gonna be fighting with. It's just beautiful quality. I really, really like this. I would have never thought to do something like this. I have to tell you, the more that I look at this setup, the more in love with it I am. I actually really like it under my TV, but I have to say, I want something really simple for my mantle this year. Put those candelabras on my mantle, kind of uh, lay the garland down, get some mini white and medium white pumpkins and kind of sprinkle them through chic decor, easy, beautiful, bada bing, bada boom, your mantle is done. You could do that on your dining room table also. I also, like I said, have trouble after Christmas knowing what to do on my dining room table. That garland is perfect. You could set this out year round. I love the garland. You can make it a wreath, put it on your mantle, put it on your dining room table, your sideboard, your entryway. It can go in so many places in your home for all the seasons, but that candelabra really too, it could go in a fireplace. It could go on a um, the hearth it could go on a like your sideboard wherever you want I really like them mixed together though and you can mix so many different things in with the seasons like I said white pumpkins or red berries or yellow flowers in the spring I just love it and mix with these resin pumpkins this box is already so good but we have more okay these next two items I actually saw on her Instagram stories and thought they were beautiful but y'all in person they are so much better it is a set of two cast aluminum apple and pear serving bowls it is this gorgeous green so online they looked black but do you see the paint it's almost like marble it has this patina to it that almost looks like you found it in just some little antique shop. There's a little bit of weight to it. I really like the detail on the leaves. Is this food safe? It says, oh, for dry, food safe only. <gasps> you could put this on the corner of our charcuterie board and do like a nut mix or like some really pretty seedy crackers. That would add so much interest to a charcuterie board. So pretty, but if that's not enough, she also sent a pear. I love pears this time of year. Again, you've got that gorgeous leaf print. You know, if you could part with this, which I wouldn't want to, this would be such a fun teacher gift also. And you know what I will probably do? I We love a good cheese ball <laughs> during the holidays. I'd probably put some wax paper down so the, the wet cheese doesn't touch the bowl um, and do a cheese ball in here and some crackers in here for just a fun, we always have an appetizer table at our house and this would be fun to add to your appetizer table, wouldn't it? I think you could use these year round though. Aren't they just really, really beautiful? So let's see what it says about that. Drawing inspiration from autumn's seasonal bounty, these cast aluminum apple and pear shaped serving bowls possess a hand patina verdigris finish and are perfect for putting out dry snacks or to use as a complimentary side dish to your charcuterie board for when company drops in. It's almost black patina and sleek lines are perfect for those that love farmhouse or contemporary design. Dry food safe using food grade um, lacquer, hand wash and dry with a damp cloth. Really pretty, just really pretty. I'm gonna show you them one more time. I don't know, do you like the apple or the pear the best? 
hard to it's hard to choose, isn't it? And then we always have our one staple item that is in every single My Pro box item, and that is her reusable tote. I talked about this before. These live in my car. I try to carry all my groceries in here. I have one bag that's just dedicated to my post office bag. When I'm going to the post office, it's got really soft, soft handles. So if you're carrying a lot, it's not digging into your shoulder. It's long enough to fit under your arm. And I love that she's helping us save the environment not using so many plastic bags with this it's actually got quite a bit of room inside too it's very deep and got a pretty good base down there so you can get lots and lots of fresh fruits and vegetables in here like i said this one lives in my car i have probably six or seven of them now and i can never have enough of them so every box will get that so what did you think of the box tell me what your favorite item is again if you want to get it you can use my discount code for 15 dollars off your first purchase either of the box in the marketplace or in the holiday shop these boxes start shipping next week so go ahead and grab yours if you get one let me know in the comments below again don't forget to hit that subscribe button i hope you like what you see and i'll see you soon for another video guys Bye bye